Maine is one of the top potato producing states in the country. Maine potato farmers also focus on growing larger potatoes that are just for the food service industry. As New Center Maine's Hanny Ashivi reports, as much as 40% of those potatoes are sitting at farms because of the shutdown of restaurants, cafeterias, and state fairs. Potatoes stacking up and forming mountains. Like nothing I've ever seen. With restaurants closed for weeks and some now just opening in a limited capacity, many of these potatoes are not finding a home. At what point in time are we storing too much that we're going to end up having to take to the fields uh, and dispose of them? Michael Hart is the director of sales and marketing at Green Thumb Farms in Freiburg. He says his food service business is down about 70% which represents 45% of overall sales. A lot of the sizes that we have for food service don't generally get sold at retail. Large sized potatoes that retail stores like Hannaford don't usually take, but they've seen success with the product in their 183 stores throughout New England. We have bought 500,000 pounds more than we normally would have purchased this time of year. The demand has skyrocketed for potatoes at Hannaford's. It's definitely the driver of local product uh, that's, that's moving for a produce lift in sales. But many potato farms are not able to repackage for retail. It's not so easy as just to say, oh, well, we're gonna, what we don't sell to McDonald's, we're gonna sell to Hannaford Brothers. It's, it's a much more complex problem than that. Senator King is trying to seek alternative markets for the crop with the Department of Agriculture. Have the, the, the federal government buy them and then distribute them to food pantries and uh, uh, all over the country. The Secretary of Agriculture answered Senator King's letter, acknowledging his efforts on behalf of potato farmers in Maine, stating his concerns will be taken into consideration in the final rulemaking of the Coronavirus Food Assistance Program Act. Millions of dollars sitting there that we're having to continue to uh, manage. You know, the bumper sticker, no farms, no food. And we want to keep them supplying that food for all of us. In an effort to help farmers, Hannaford tells me it will keep supplementing these potatoes as long as the demand is there. COVID-19, making it a challenging year, even for the main potato. Hannah Yashivi, New Center, Maine. And Hannaford tells us it is actively seeking relationships with farmers who want to find a different market and see their retail stores as a potential avenue for selling their product.